the first one, he came directly and uh, put his hand up on my face, you know. This is Mrs. Wick's car, and this is the trunk of the car where she spent more than five hours last night. Five cold hours inside. It's about five feet long and about two and a half feet wide. It all started last night in front of the Atlanta Hilton Hotel. Mrs. Merle Wick, who works as a cashier in the hotel coffee shop, was parking her car at a service station across the street when two men with a gun grabbed her. They told her if she cried out, they'd kill her. They put her in the trunk of her own car. Mrs. Wick says they drove around for several hours, didn't say what they were up to. At one point, they picked up another woman that one of the men got in the back seat with. During this five hours that you spent in the trunk, what was the worst time for you? The worst time was when I, I, I heard this this girl, uh, you know, crying and say, you're hurting me. And The girl they picked up, you believe they raped her, at least one of them. Right. And you thought? That probably that's what, uh, you know, was, I was going to end up that way. Mrs. Wick didn't know it at the time, but a Hilton Hotel security officer had witnessed her abduction and reported it to police. About five hours after the ordeal began, a patrol officer spotted Mrs. Wick's missing car in front of the Tasty Dog restaurant on Northside Drive. Police grabbed one of the suspects as he came out of the restaurant, the second as he fled into the kudzu. Then an officer freed Mrs. Wick's unharmed from the trunk of her car. Because it was cold. Don McClellan, Action News.